Yo, what's going on guys? Element Games here back with another video and today's video we are going to be doing a showcase on AGL Bardock at full level 10 links in Dokkan Battle today. So let's go ahead and see what he can really do at maximum power at the 55% level. Bruh. Alright, so this Bardock, he is one of the most forgotten Dokkan Fest of 2020, I would say. Probably the most, if I had to um, name one. It's between, got it's gotta be between him and like Exchange Boo, but everybody talks about Exchange Boo because of his leader skill and his Majin Boo links and maybe because of how much the truth hates him sometimes or slanders him. Um, I'm not gonna get too much into that, um, but this guy, I would say, is definitely the most forgotten and this guy is special to me because when me and icy had done a summoning video on this guy i like like th there was like the first summoning video that actually did really well on our channel so he he hold, he holds a, a good a good place in my heart for sure so you know months and months later i actually decided to start like leveling up his links and um just like about what from now it's got to be like only like 12 ish hours tw not 12 ish i'm stupid like around 24 ish hours from when i let um got him to link level 10 it's probably slightly less than 24 so not even like a full day has passed um and i just got him to level 10 links so um we are doing doing pretty good here so so like i said um in the introduction we have him at the free dupe level 55 percent and he is he has a uh, crit equipment and a uh, level four attack. Okay, interesting, interesting. So that's where his things are looking for the hidden potential. That's where his abilities. So we have them here on the his own team, the revenge team um, slash low class warrior team. And I had to take this opportunity to use him on his team specifically because I had found a rainbow Bardock. So I guess while while we're here, you guys can see the sticker effect for um, Bardock. Um, I don't know how many people actually put it on him. Um, I, he's somebody I would actually like to put it on, I'm not gonna lie, like, he's actually somebody that I'd probably, I'd probably put it on, there we go, looking nice and, um, 60 FPS. Alright, so, starting out here, we have him on a rotation with Kid Goku and the LR Bardock, or LR Team Bardock, I should say. Um, this is, this LR is very, it's a very good free-to-play LR, um, not, nothing too crazy, but a very cool free-to-play LR, it's just a shame for me specifically um <laughs> the super attack isn't leveled up that much but let's hope they shouldn't kill because uh, because of that reason like they they're not they shouldn't be hidden too hard um so what bardock's at 97k defense okay starting out almost like about 100k defense kid goku's at 100k defense which is very nice but yeah about 100k defense and um he's got a lot of links active here so this should be a very good turn starting out here um, so the the LR is providing support here. I'm pretty sure it's a 30% yeah 30% support, and then you get an extra 30% if you're part of the team Bardock um, team. So that's how their support works. So like they shouldn't do too much damage here. Yeah, 700,000. Um, yeah, they shouldn't do enough damage to just go ahead and kill Janemba here. So we can go ahead and see what Bardock hits. 2.4. That's a very good attack. That very very good attack. That actually. Very impressive, Bardock. Very impressive for his base form. That I'll take that. That is very good, and his defense is gonna. He just raised it, so it's over 100k right now. So he he, he does he does take only 100k from the super, or oh, about 90k, to be fair. Um, so not bad, not bad. I mean, that's Janemba doing 100k is actually even surprising. Like, I, it's the first phase of an event, so you don't usually I don't expect the first phase to be doing that much damage. But kudos to you, Janemba. Kudos to you. So. We have him here, so we have the Rainbow Bardock here. I guess we can get a look at him as well. We'll keep the Rainbow Bardock on this rotation, and then we'll, we'll compare numbers. So the Rainbow Bardock, his links are not nearly as leveled up as mine. But um, it's still rainbowed at the end of the day, so, you know, it's still a good showing. So we're, we're going we're gonna to keep him over on this rotation. 
and um, we're going to be comparing. So next turn, we have some more support. So 2.47 here. Okay, okay. So even higher. So it looks like the dupes actually do really um, affect Bardock, which is good to know. Dupes do affect Bardock because he his links aren't nearly as leveled up as mine. And what is it called? And he ha didn't have as many links active. All he did was have the 40% support. So that tells me for sure, yeah, the, um, the uh, links are uh, not the links the dudes definitely are affecting him okay so we have a um, decent bit of links actives again no fierce battle though so he's at 140k defense let's see if team bardock kills if team bardock does kill it's not that big a deal like it's 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 not a big deal we can get um other attack sets later on but um i definitely want to see um this rotation but there's a chance they definitely could kill i'm not i'm not gonna lie um this super attack will do damage because you know they're not defensive and it feels like it took off a lot of hp because our health isn't that high on this team i don't know 940 like this is only the second phase in the dokkan event i'm not sure if it'll kill i feel like it could it didn't okay good 2.31 okay so yeah it looks like getting fierce battle uh definitely influenced his attack like to go up like um, definitely a lot higher you can tell because that time we had double support but he still hit lower so i mean common sense just tells you that big um not um, but, well, i was about to say big bad bosses fierce battle is a uh, very very important link for bardock so now we have a uh, this is the rainbow the rainbow bardock here um we're gonna transform him but before we do that let me do this active skill um never get to see this active skill like at all so uh i love when i get this off i love when i get this off we took a lot of damage last turn so you know this, this is this is always super nice to see Goku has guaranteed crits on this turn too. This the Kid Goku is such a good unit. Like, um, I'm gonna actually look at their defenses on this turn. No support. I want to see where they're all sitting. Okay, so there we go. Guaranteed hit because it's an active skill. So, 150k for Bardock, 100k for Goku, and 90k for Trunks. Trunks is only 55%, so that makes sense. Um, what do I want to do here? If I if I activate his um his transformation, I want to see how many links he activates with the Trunks then we'll see like um where i'll decide where i want to like put him in the rotation if i want to put um kid goku first trunks first probably not trunks first because trunks might just kill let's see there he gets those okay so he doesn't change links okay so yeah we'll do this um all right that and get those orbs okay so let's see what a rainbow bardock will do here not he has the dodging damage reduction and against an extreme class enemy he has super effect against all types and I think against Wicked Bullion, that's when he gets the crits. Or it's the other way around. It's one of the one of those. He crit there, but I don't know if that was from the passive or from the hidden potential because he's rainbowed. But this is where Bardock shows out. If he doesn't crit here, then we know that he gets crits against Wicked Bloodline. And then... Okay, so yeah. Crits against Wicked Bloodline, effect, super effect against all types against uh, Extreme Class. So this is this this is his type of event. This is where Bardock um, really shows what he can do here. So... Let's see, how many links do we have? We have a lot of links active here. We'll lose a link, I think, when we transform. But I definitely want to transform because I want to see uh, what Bardock will do. I want to see what Bardock will do transformed as well. We need to see that in the video. So we've seen a lot of his base form. So yeah, let's, let's go ahead and, and transform him here and see what he can do. Um, very, very nice looking active skill. Very, very nice. And the 3D model right here, like the one in the thumbnail very good um really good looking um asset so let's see okay so we're gonna put we're gonna put bardock here and i probably should use an item let's look at his defense but i'll use an item but let's look at his defense so it's 143k okay so keep that in mind we'll raise we'll raise their defense and stuff here so just keep keep that in mind that like it, the defense will be different yeah 200k we also we might need more than that because freaking turtle is back there okay that should be enough should be <laughs> okay so the team Bardock here will get will get an attack as well. Um, so Bardock here he has 18% chance to dodge, 18% damage reduction. He has um, was it a high chance to do an additional against um, extreme class? It's high or medium? I'm not looking at the passive right now, so I don't have it memorized. Um, I think it's a high chance to do an it's like he does an additional attack with like a high chance to do a super attack or a, a additional with a medium chance to do a super. It's one of those. But, um, very good for, um, that. Okay, so, 2.9 there, almost 3 million. Very good, very good, very good. This is a very good, without, like, Wings, like, Super Saiyan being active, like, this is very good. So, he crit there, and he did not get the, um, the additional attack, but, you know, 
he, he, he could get, he can get an attack, I'm pretty sure. Unless it's only against, um, I, I, I don't have it, like, memorized. But, um, okay. So, he's, this Rainbow Bardock's got some support here. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Let's see what this, um, this, this Rainbow Bardock can do. This is super good to see. I like, I like being able to look at these, um, be, look at the difference between a 55%. Um, and then the rainbowed one, so it's, it's very nice to see, but let's see, let's see, let's see, I'm, I'm very eager, I'm very eager. Okay, okay, get your attacks over. Don't have to keep dodging, Janema, come on, come on. Don't dodge this one, don't dodge this one. 2.7, okay, he dodged it though. <laughs> Are you gonna dodge this one? Okay, cool, cool, cool. So, 2.7 there, okay, 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 very, very nice from the rainbow bardock as well. Okay, so, let's go ahead and move on to another team, because I'm pretty sure we don't have any, like, we just have the, yeah, we just have the first rotation, right, as the next rotation, so we don't need to, um, we don't really need to see that over again, there's no reason to, so let's go move on to the another team, or I think we're going to move on to Angel Golden Frieza's team, I think that's where I want to go. Alright, so we have Bardock on the Golden Frieza's Angel, Angel Golden Frieza's Revived Warriors and Otherworld Warriors team, so we have them here on a rotation, with the uh, Bardock, the Super Saiyan 2 Bardock unit, so that's very nice, and we're going to put it, actually him in the first slot, because we want to take damage, so on this rotation, he's got 74k defense, so 74k is not that um, not that great, I'm not going to lie, obviously, um, but remember that in this form, he does stack his defense on super attack, and then when he transforms, he loses the stacking, but you can, you can choose when to transform, in this case, for a showcase, I, this is why I went against this Frieza. We're going to transform right away here because we want to um, just start seeing attack stats and stuff and start just shooting out like some really good numbers. So me personally, I'm just going to, yeah, I'm just going to transform right away and we'll see how many links he has active here. But um, yeah, this, the, the, if, if this wasn't like a, like a Dokkan event, like I probably just like, you know, start, I keep, like if this was a legendary Frieza event, imagine like that event was out. I'd just be like stacking like I wouldn't be um, I wouldn't be transforming like this so I want to take damage here because um, we need to take damage in order for uh, Super Saiyan Th I want to get Super Saiyan 3 Bardock's passive to activate but we have to take damage so I'm just doing that so okay so 2.5 there all right not not too shabby this is only a 150 lead so keep that in mind as well that's why his defense is slightly lower but he did he does just guarantee crit with Wicked Bloodline so as long as he super attacks, we're pretty much going to finish off the thing in one shot. And then he has, like, the additionals, damage reduction, dodging. He does, when he's versus an extreme class enemy, he does, he does like, every single thing in the world of, um, things. So, <laughs> so, it's quite difficult to really do much to him when he's, when, when, when that stuff is, um, activated. So, like, if you're, if you're, yeah, if you're going to try and, uh, try it like if you're trying to try i'm not gonna say do anything to him if we're gonna try and like block him in his way you know he he, he can't really um be blocked because he's got critting and super effective when he's versing an extreme class so, like you're not really gonna be able to get past that and no enemy gets past that not not both of those especially like if you're if you're a, a wicked bloodline enemy specifically you ain't getting past crits additionals that are also critting Dodging, damage reduction, you, you, it's too much, it's too much. Alright, so right here we have a rotation. We don't have Bardock's passive active, because if we did, then, you know, things would be looking a lot different here. But we do have a lot of links active, so that's nice. How many, who, who, who does he share more links with? He shares, um, he shares the same amount of links with both, but, um, I guess we want to, we want to go with the one who shares better links right super saiyan I, okay so well for this rotation i'm just gonna do this i'm gonna put him in the middle um if we had the support here from bardock this he would be looking like crazy good i might try and do that i might try to get a turn like that because that that would be a really good turn but um sadly we couldn't get that to activate but yeah if we did it'd be super good why is he dodging interesting okay 2.9. Um, why was that Bardock dodging? Am I tripping? Did I put dodging him? <laughs> That's odd. Um, okay, sure. Why not? Um, okay, let's move on here. Let's move on here. Okay, we're just gonna press these. Try to not, um, we're not gonna worry about any of this. I wanna try to stall so we can get, like, the most attack stats, but as you see, like, um, when Bardock attacks, he pretty much just, like, one-shots the phase, so it's 
pretty hard to stall when you, when you're just like when the unit you're trying to showcase is literally just one shotting. But I'm doing my best here. I'm doing my best here. Um, I really do want to get that rotation though with the um with like all the Bardocks and stuff. Like I really do want to get that, but like that's gonna be mighty difficult. Okay, so we're gonna put um we don't get any actual. There's no way we get yeah. We, there's no way we get links from Frieza. Like for what reason? So we're gonna put Bardock in the front and center, and we're just gonna have him do do his thing. So he should have lost his um damage reduction and his uh and all that by now. So that that should be gone. Um, but he will have what's it called? He, he does he does still have like the, the critting and the additionals. So keep that in mind as well. Oh, I guess he does still have the dodging. Okay, that should probably be over by now, right? I would assume. Okay, it has to be over. Cause we yeah we did get um it would I think that was the last turn because we got him in the seventh slot so I gotta remember that um okay we really can't stall though like it's really impossible to stall I don't think it's it's possible because like Bardock will do too much he'll do, he'll do he'll do too much I can't wait another turn to get there's no way I could get another turn I'll try but um. I'll I'll cut I'll cut right now and see if we can get that turn if I don't then we don't. Alright, so somehow miraculously, we actually ended up getting the um, rotation. We ended up stalling that long. Um, okay, so now he's got the extra attack active. He's got all these links active, and he's got the extra attack from um, from Super Saiyan three Bardock. So we'll go see what this what this attacks that will be. I don't want to get a Doke on attack. Do not want to get a Doke on attack. Um, let's use an item here too. Let's definitely use an item. We'll, we'll use two just to be safe. Um, we don't get a Dokkan attack on this turn, I don't think, right? Please don't. Good, 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 good. Alright, we literally got perfect luck here in order for this to work, because, uh, what? Okay, I was about to say, I was like, yo, that Bardock did more damage than I thought for a 400k attack set, what the heck? This Frieza been so old, though, that's the problem. Okay, let's see. What does Bardock hit on this turn? 3.2, okay, okay. 3.2 was guaranteed crits. And, um, he has a, a high chance, he has an additional that has a high chance to be super, I'm pretty sure. Or medium chance to be super, one of those. And if this was earlier on, then he would have had damage reduction. He would have dodging. Um, and he has high defense. So, uh, pretty good there. Pretty good by Bono. Alright, so, we have a rotation here that I just wanted to see, like, something super interesting. Um, I wanted to see where Bardock's base form could do, like, a lot of damage and kind of, like, max out. So... What I decided to do was, um, I'm not gonna transform him here, even though it seems super, um, it seems super intriguing, but he shares so much links in his base form with the, um, Bardock and Gide that I feel like I have to keep him in base, because he'll lose, like, um, he'll lose a couple of those when he transforms, so that's why I'm only, I'm gonna keep him in base for this. So, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna do, um, two active skills. So, two active skill buffs are gonna make Bardock um definitely shoot up in attack um to say the least so bardock should look very good on this turn even in his base form so i haven't stacked with him at all even though it's turn four i i missed the super attack but so yeah we're gonna see what bardock can do on this turn i just want to see what he can do in his base because look at he shares all these things he has all these actors so i want to i want to see um probably gonna use some damage reduction, you know, because Bardock and Gine aren't the most defensive, but you know, it's fine. And then, yeah, let's see. I want, I really, I'm really interested. What, what does Bardock do? We'll probably end it off with this because we've seen Super Saiyan Bardock a lot in this video, so I want to see some more base Bardock. So, okay, okay, okay. Moment of truth. What does my boy Bardock do? 3.1. Okay, so yeah, he that that's that's kind that's that's kind of where he's gonna max out for the most part. The only thing you also you can do is make the entire team um, low class warrior, but I don't know if you could do that. I'm not sure if you could do that in Goku Family. You probably could, but that's the only yeah, that's literally the only other thing you could do. So that's where we're gonna end off here. Um, let's go to Bardock. All right, so I thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to comment, like, subscribe, and share the video with some people, maybe on social media. And um, we appreciate you. Um, if you if you would subscribe because we're trying to get to a thousand by the end of the year so um, Help us reach our goal help us reach our goal if you enjoyed showcases like this well, I've got more coming I've got at least three more of these level 10 link showcases and maybe by then we'll have another one because I'm close To level 10 links on another character as well um, but yeah 
I think that Bardock did um did really well here. He he is definitely a, it's definitely a step up from where he was before uh, without the links because he was very um, underwhelming to me um, compared to like some some of these units and where his attack stats still aren't the highest nowadays. With dupes, you can see, you can tell it would change because you saw that rainbowed one at the beginning of the video. It was doing like around the same damage as mine that was um, had better support next to it and had level 10 links. So if I had my part off rainbowed, those numbers probably would have shot up like it, been, it, it would've, probably would have been like four or five million. So keep that in mind as well. So uh, yeah, I, I like I said, I appreciate you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.